Either way, can come back on my house after it's feeling. Anyways, that, that's stupid. But that's how I'm going to start the story. And so anyways, <laughs> I'm on the freeway, right? And there's an off-ramp, you know, and on the, the, when I take that off-ramp, there's a signal light there, and there's always been a homeless man standing there with a sign. And I'm in my car, so I always just ignore the guy, right? And it's like kind of weird, you know? Have you guys been driving and seeing a homeless person ask for money? It just kind of feels weird, right? Because you're in your car. Yeah, and you're like, radio's on, I'm singing. And so that's what I do, you know, I usually ignore them, right? But this one day, I, I, I pull up and it's a, it's a red light, and there's like four or five cars in front of me, and I'm scarfing down these carrots I had left over in the Ziploc bag from lunch. And uh, behind me pulls this monster truck, and it's got like tinted windows, so I can't really see who it is, if it's a man or woman. I just feel the pressure of a monster truck, you know, and I just feel like as soon as it turns green, I better go because the monster truck can go and just run over us. And so I, that's the way I think, I, I, for whatever reason. Panicky. <laughs> But uh, so I feel that pressure, and I'm like starting down my carriage really fast, and I look over, and I see a homeless woman there. Not a homeless man, usually I'd be like, hey, get a job, you dude. But there's a woman, so like, my heart kind of went out to her, and I was like, I know I should give her something. And in LA, you have to pay for parking everywhere. So my cup holders are full of quarters. I was like, you know what? I'm going to scoop these quarters up, put them in the Ziploc bag, and give them to her. You know? And so I scoop them up and I put them out. I'm like, whoa, this is heavy. This is like two pounds worth of quarters. This is awesome. It's going to change your life. And so I roll down the window and I put my hand out like this. I'm going to say she's like four or five cars away. So she's a good distance away. And she's all over by the light. And I put it out like this. And she sees me and she puts her sign down and she goes like this. I'm like, what? Do you want to get out of the car and take this? This is stupid. This doesn't make any sense. And I'm like, I don't know, like, I'm like, I, right there, I'm just like, what? Right? And then the light turns green, and these cars in front of me just take off, you know? And because I have this in my head, like, oh my gosh, I'm going to go, I just start going, right? And so I'm going, and I'm approaching her fairly fast, 20, 30 miles an hour. And I'm like, wait a second, how's this exchange going to happen? You know? <laughs> then in my mind, I'm like, uh, all right, technique one, <laughs> slam it into her belly, you know? And she's like, oh, we're going! You know? And then I started thinking, that's not going to work out. She's not a football player. And it's like, what if she hold on to the bag too long and pulls me out of the car and I die? Or if I don't let go in time and I drag her under the car and put her over, you know? And the monster truck thing do it runs her over. So I'm freaking out, you know? And I'm approaching her really fast. And I'm like, hey, John, you're a martial artist. All you need to do is focus. Just do this, right? You'll watch it. Gracefully. Fly out of my hand into her hand, right? So I'm just like, okay, yeah, 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 that's a good idea. So I got this two pound bag of quarters in my hand going 20, 30 miles an hour. I'm like, eh. I'm like oh, just like that. I want to just a flick. And I watch. And, and for whatever reason, like if you've been in an accident, time does slow down, and you know this. And so as I do this, like everything slows down as though God was like, wait, 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 wait. Watch this. So, go watch it. And so I watch. I watch. As this two pound bag of quarters leaves my hand at 20 or 30 miles an hour. Two pounds worth. Homeless woman, here. I watch as this two pound bag of quarters flies through the air and smacks her in the face. 20 or 30 miles an hour. Smacks in her face. Not, it doesn't stop there. It, it like it becomes beautiful. And I, it's in slow motion, guys. And so I hit her. It breaks open. Quarters fly everywhere. Uh, and so I'm like, as all I can do is like, no. And I, I'm going so fast that when I turn, I actually screech around the corner like, like it's a drive-by quartering. <laughs> And then the other guy in the truck behind me is like, douchebag, <laughs> slow down, get out of the car. Anyways, that's a true story.